China has revealed a Mach 4 supersonic jet prototype, twice as fast as the Concorde. Today, we'll look at exciting new changes in supersonic travel, focusing on China's Yunxing prototype. What could this mean for how we fly around the world? Let's get right into it. Fly from Beijing to New York in as little as two hours. That dream is closer to reality with the Yunxing prototype, which recently completed a successful test flight on October 26th. Developed by space transportation, this cutting-edge aircraft can soar at speeds of Mach 4, twice the speed of the legendary Concorde, which was retired two decades ago. The Yunxing is designed for vertical takeoff and landing, allowing it to operate in various environments. The aircraft can reach impressive altitudes of over 20,000 meters or 65,600 feet. Its high lift-to-drag ratio means it can maintain efficient performance as it climbs through thinner air, making it not just fast, but also economical. Space transportation isn't stopping here. The company plans to conduct further engine technology tests in November. These assessments are crucial as they aim for a 2027 launch of a fully operational, commercially viable supersonic passenger jet. Founded in 2018 in Sichuan province, space transportation has quickly grown, establishing research and development centers in Beijing, Xi'an, and Anhui. They also have a test facility in Korla, Xinjiang, where they push the boundaries of aerospace technology. Space transportation is not just about the Yunxing, they are also developing a range of hypersonic technologies, including suborbital space tourism vehicles. Their innovative approach could redefine global transportation. Working closely with China's military, research institutes, and universities, space transportation is at the forefront of advancing hypersonic and supersonic technologies. This collaboration helps them stay ahead in a competitive field. On October 26th, the Yunxing underwent extensive testing of its key components, including aerodynamics, thermal protection, and control systems. These rigorous tests ensure that the aircraft can handle the extreme conditions it will face in flight. The Concorde, which operated from 1976 to 2003, set the standard for supersonic travel. It could fly at altitudes of 60,000 feet and complete a London to New York flight in just under three and a half hours. The Tupolev Tu-144 was its competitor, making its first supersonic flight in June 1969. Today, companies like Boom Supersonic are reigniting interest in supersonic travel. Their Overture aircraft aims for transatlantic flights by 2029, while the XB-1 prototype recently completed its first flight in July 2024. In the UK, Reaction Engines is working on a revolutionary engine that could make transatlantic flights in just two hours a reality. This project aims to combine speed with efficiency, pushing the limits of what we thought possible in aviation. What are your thoughts? Could the Yunxing prototype change the way we travel forever? Let us know in the comments below.